Wednesday, October 23rd. <sighs> Still, uh, every time I push that button, and I forget, I usually forget. It's got to recover the data before it can film. But as I've said before, it's still it's still filming. It's still working. So we are good. Oh my goodness! <laughs> oh, just got home from the parks and the rec. Uh, didn't really do much today. Uh, they had they had a water leak. I think uh, when I first got well, I ended up. Um, I was waiting to hear from Peter, and uh, or somebody. I forgot Mallory was off today. Um, but I was waiting to hear, and uh, you know, if they were on their way or what, um, to come pick me up. And Peter finally, uh, I got a text from him, at maybe a ten quarter after nine, something like that. He said, "Oh, I'm on my way to get you." And then he texted back, "I'll meet you at Shepherd Park." So I was like, "Oh, I'll, you know, I'll head that way," because <laughs> I wasn't sure. I mean, for the last couple of days they've been picking me up here at my apartment, you know. Um, Passenger Princess, I believe that's how Mallory would put it. Um, <laughs> front door service. Um, but uh, there, there had been like... I, I don't know if... It, he said so. Uh, so I, I went to Shepherd Park to wait for him, and I was like waiting there f for a little bit. Uh, you know, just waiting. And then uh, I got a text that said... Uh, they were trying to fix a water fountain, so he's like, I'll come get you as soon as I can, or you might just have to walk here. And I'm like, that's fine. I can walk. It's fine. I'm already like half, kind of halfway-ish there anyway by the time I hit the Shep Shepherd Park. At least a third of the way there. So it's like, you know, I'm already out stretching my legs. But yeah, so I don't know if the fountain was leaking. I don't know. I was leaking, and I didn't know they had the water shut off. So I just, by the time I got to the shop, I had to to piece, and so I pieced, and then I couldn't flush the toilet, so just had to let my yellow mellow for a little bit, but that's fine. Uh, <laughs> I, t I warned people. I was like, oh, by the way, I didn't know there wasn't water, and I couldn't flush the toilet. Peter's like, well, at least you didn't take a shit. And I'm like, yeah, I guess. <laughs> but, uh, silver lining. Every cloud apparently has one. Uh, so yeah, we were working on that for a little bit. Um, and then I guess they were winterizing the bathrooms. Uh, and uh, they were they were working on that. Uh, or they were going to work on that. And at first, Gabe was going to have me be the note taker. Like, you know, write down what they were doing. Um, and so that they could kind of put together this, you know, kind of like we did with the, the pool, you know. Uh, Mallory was the the... Uh, note taker during that period of time, but she wasn't there today. She had the day off, so uh, it was going to be me. But then he decided to have Charles and I go look uh, at branches, at sticks, to see if there was any branches we could pick up or whatever, or like check out the situation at uh, Mar Park because there's the tree that we we it's in the same area, and there was a tree that like had started to fall but hadn't fallen all the way yet. It was going to fall someday. Well, apparently someday finally came. Because uh, I'm pretty sure that's the tree that they thought was going to... F it was like, oh, we should take... You know, Peter kind of wanted to take care of it right then and there. But uh, we didn't. And now it's it's there to be taken care of. Uh, but he had Charles and I, you know, driving around to the parks just to make sure everything looked kosher. Um, I got introduced to a park today that I didn't even know existed. It's called Bear Creek. It's in the middle of all these these houses um, over there. I don't know, there's like this round thing. I don't know, like, I don't know. If I lived in there, I'd fucking get lost. I'd never find my way home. I'd never find my way out again, I feel like. Because Charles was driving down these streets, and I'm like, I have no idea where the fuck I am. Uh, <laughs> right now, I was like, this does not look familiar to me at all. <sighs> but just, I'd have to GPS my way in and out of there every single fucking time, I think, right? Minks decided now that I'm making a video because I came in the door and she was just laying over there doing, you know, just napping. Like, oh, I'm tired. I'm just going to lay here and sleep. And now that I'm trying to make a video, 
that's when she has decided attention is relevant and needed. But, but yeah, so we were just kind of doing that, just driving around town, checking out the parks, making sure everything was kosher. Um, why are you blipping? Oh, no. Miss Minx. <laughs> Miss Meeks, why are you blepping? Why are you blepping? Oh my goodness. <sighs> anyway, and then Charles went to lunch. Uh, I, th I thought he went to lunch pretty much right around noon. Um, um, so I just kind of went down and I was like cleaning up the shop a little bit and putting away the tools that were in the back of the gator. Um, all that kind of fun stuff. Um, I thought it was around one o'clock, and so I kind of was like upstairs, like looking around, waiting for him, because I thought he would be back right about one o'clock. Uh, but he may have just decided to go on home. I don't know. I don't know if there there wasn't really much mowing for him to do, because um, he was going to go mowing. Um, but but uh, Riley and Peter got back, so Peter brought me home. And I was like, I wasn't really dirty. I didn't even worry about showering today. I was kind of like, eh, whatever, man. Uh, I did try to, once again, I got some Gorilla Glue this time. Gel. Gorilla Glue gel. To try to glue that little thing back together. And it still didn't work. So, uh, there. I, I wonder if I could take out... The, well, of course, they're probably glued in there now. Because I've tried to glue... <laughs> I've tried to glue the head back on. Or technically it's at the neck. The neck piece. Um... So I wonder if I could, because then maybe I would be dealing with more of a flat surface with the with the vertebrate, you know, uh, and the neck smashed together. Um, so those those little screws that were in there might have been getting in my way, but too late now. But yeah, I can kind of tuck his head into his rib cage. So I guess that's how I'm gonna have to do it, because gorilla glue. I mean. You know, we know what it does to a lady's head when she uses it. Did she use it as shampoo? I can't remember. Or styling gel. She used it as styling gel for some reason. Um, like, it should have stuck, but it didn't. But, and then I made myself some noodles. And they smell pretty good. So it's a new, like, honey... I think I showed them off the other day when I was showing off my cabinet. Uh, how much food I had in there. The honey ginger chicken, I think it is. Hmm. So, got that waiting for me. But first, questiones of the Delesis on the 23rd. Yes, 23rd. What was the last thing you really wanted but didn't get? Probably a good win at the casino. Uh, <laughs> I think I was telling this, that story the other day uh, about how, like, that, that one time, and it was, it was I, I can't remember if it was back when I was trying to save the house uh, before the foreclosure, uh, before I gave up and just let them have it back or what. Um, but there was, like, I was, I was at a casino. We were on one of, I don't know if it was, uh, I, we've been on so many little trips. I don't know. I don't know if it was Mom's birthday trip or... Uh, my birthday trip, maybe. Mom sometimes takes us on a little overnight doodly daddy or a weekend trip for my birthday. You know. Um, but we were at the casino and it was like, I was almost hitting that 5,000, like two or three times on the big wheel at the top. And I was like, oh man, it would like, like go and make it look like it was going to stop on it or it would stop right before. Um, you know, it made it look like it was going to stop on it, and then it would click over to the next one. I was like, oh, oh, like at, at least, I like, I think at least twice it did it. Maybe three times. I can't remember. I'm like, that is so rude. That is so rude. Because oh, I could have used 5000 I mean, I can use $5,000 now, for fuck's sake, you know. Um, so, a good win at the casino, or on the scratchers tickets. When mom was here last weekend, she bought some scratch, scratchers tickets. We probably would have won on the one because I couldn't get my card to work. I was trying to, you know, uh, insert, um, you know, credits into the machine to buy scratchers with. 
and uh, it wasn't working for if my card wasn't working for some reason because we were we were getting the uh, the the new Christmas uh, ones are out the new Christmas scratchers are out, um, and so we're like oh let's try the Christmas ones, you know and uh, <laughs> it was we didn't win shit we didn't win jack fucking shit, but we probably would have won on the ones that I wasn't able to buy because I wasn't able to put they were I think they were like five dollar cards or something. Uh, just gonna put ten dollars in, you know, buy one for me and one for mom. That's probably the ones we would have won on, but since I wasn't able to fucking buy it because it wouldn't take my card, I'm still poor. Thanks, thanks universe. <laughs> or it kept me from wasting ten ten more dollars that I didn't need to waste. That's probably more more so the case. But uh, I don't even know how much you could win on that one, but. <laughs> I haven't heard about anybody winning a big amount. Of course, I don't know if they'd tell you that or not. I don't know if that'd be in the local news. Like, oh, somebody won a bunch of money on a scratcher's ticket. Oh, great. Thanks. So mad. <laughs> Could have been me. Could have been mom. But no. Because, um, I mean, I don't really want much of anything. Um, I want peace. I want tranquility. I want to not have to wake up and go to work and be an adult. But unfortunately, never get that. Never get that, usually. Um, you gotta go into the hospital for a few days. And then you get a week off. <laughs> That's how you do it, apparently. I found, I found, I found the secret this year. Uh, but, or just ask for a day off. I keep meaning to do that. But uh, I forget. I forget. <sighs> Cause, I mean, I don't really want much of anything that I can think of. I mean, there's some stuff that I guess it would be nice to have for my collectibles. Like, you know, uh, the original red and the original pink uh, Power Ranger Funko Pops. They re-released them later with different poses, but I don't want the different poses. I want the poses, the original poses that all the rest of them have. Because they finally did release, you know, all the other rangers and then they release them without helmets which i only have jason the red ranger thanks to mary lee she found it somewhere and bought it for me while she was out and about or at least she messaged me and asked me if i wanted it and i was like yeah sure as long as the box is good i don't know if the box because you know i, I our, our our interpretations of what the box uh is good um, apparently differ because there was a few things I don't know if I would have bought it myself if I had seen it on the shelf but oh well um, see I mean there might be some stuff that it like it would be nice to finish a collectible a set of, I don't even know if I have a set of collectibles I don't know but I don't know so there might be something like but I guess there's not really there's not really anything I want um, it would be nice to have a 3D TV to go with my 3D Blu-ray player. That's about the only thing that I can think of that I want, want. Uh, that I would, you know, want, want, want. Because then I would have the setup to... Because I bought a whole bunch of 3D Blu-rays and I've never been able to watch them because I have the 3D Blu-ray player. Um, thanks to the Muppet movie. Uh, when, when the... Uh, was it just called The Muppets? It's the one with... Um, Is his name Jason? Is his name Jason? Um, the guy from How I Met Your Mother. He was in, you know, that one, uh, that one Muppets movie, which might have just been, might have just been called The Muppets. I don't know. Um, for Muppet, Muppets Most Wanted, I think that was the sequel. Um, but yeah, I, I bought I bought the the Muppet movie because um, it had some kind of special. Thing with it, I can't remember what. Uh, so I thought it's like, well, why I'm buying buying it? I might as well, you know, buy the Blu-ray slash DVD. Uh, you know, and then I was like, well, I need a Blu-ray player to play my Blu-ray movie. So uh, I ended up I ended up buying the Blu-ray player that can do 3D because I was like, well, while I'm at it, I might as well, you know. And but then it's like, well, you got to have a 3D TV for it to work, and I'm like, oh. 
So I've never been able to watch any of my 3D Blu-rays. <laughs> but so a, a 3D TV is about the only thing I can think of that I actually do like want. Uh, but I've never had the money to get it, so it hasn't mattered ever. You know, uh, <laughs> it doesn't really matter. You know, I want a winning lottery ticket. Um, but that requires, like, actually playing the lottery. Um, so anything like, you know, I want some kind of windfall of money would be nice. A couple thousand dollars. <clears throat> Pay off a loan or something, you know? Like, that would be nice. That would be nice. Put me on a better path, you know? That was the whole reason I was doing this whole two-job thing, was I was supposed to be paying that down. And then I don't feel like I got anywhere, and... And my situation got worse, and it's like, between, like, the taxes bullshit, and, you know, now, uh, medical bills. Of course, mom paid off all but one of my medical bills. Uh, but now i got to pay mom back, so it's still, like, a, it's still, like, a debt. But I'm pretty sure, I, I don't think she's going to sue me if I, you know, for some reason can't pay her for whatever reason, you know. She's going to court. I've been there twice, so I had my credit card sue me way back in the day whenever that was so you just form a payment plan and like okay that's you know pretty much I probably could have called them at any point and been like hey I don't know if you could I don't know. like no we want payment in full like I ain't got it in full buddy you only get what you're gonna get and you don't talk shit but boom neck drip but, uh, but yeah, there's not really anything that I like want, want that I can think of. Um, Oh shit. That's what happens, man. That's what happens. I feel like that one might have been a little bit longer than the last time I dozed off on camera. Um, but there you go. Uh, that's my answer, I suppose. <laughs> I don't know if I was in the middle of saying something or not, but uh, yeah. Welcome to my life. It's into pieces. This is my plastic fork. I don't know. Um, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, there's nothing really that I can think of that, you know, I want. Um, that I have not got. So. I guess it is what it is. That's. So before I doze off again, um, and I don't really have an answer to the question anyway, um, I guess I'm going to let you go. I'm going to go eat my noodles and uh, then doze off, maybe. So uh, <laughs> we'll see. Uh, but anyway, have a good one, and I'll see you for what I see you.